So what I did was I put like a sticker thingy in my story that says, Hey, ask me what to draw and all that kind of stuff. So little hoodie asked for an alpaca. All right, let's let's go for an alpaca here. Alpaca. Well, evolution. Yeah, I think this is where we can get a we get a good reference. This will do. Oh jeez. <laughs> I'm gonna draw the guy in the middle. I'm just gonna do a totem pole of sin. These alpacas look like they're being tortured, so I guess I'll just emulate that in my style. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this. Wait, 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 wait. That's better. And, and no, I am not erasing that line through his head. I'm the professional here. You don't tell me what to do. I love how I say I'm the professional here. <laughs> meanwhile, <laughs> meanwhile, this is my reference. I'm gonna go all Bob Ross-like and explain what I'm gonna do. So we're gonna, we're gonna take a little bit of this poop brown and we're gonna shade this. Yeah, that's gonna look really good. We don't have mistakes in art. We only have a <laughs> I can't even say that with a straight face. This close-up proves that there is many, many mistakes to be made in art. <laughs> oh my god, god, it looks disgusting. Well, multiply, please. Okay, there we go, that looks better. You can't be a digital artist without um, abusing filters. For those who don't know what alpaca evolution is, it's a really quality phone game in which you bore the alpacas and then you become a, a new abomination. And there we go. There's our... There's our... Um, <laughs> there's a... Our pillar of despair. Let's see what else you guys asked for. So, Trash Base asked for my Sonic OC. The Google reference. I think this will do. I don't know exactly what your Sonic OC looks like, but I think based on off based off of this and you know, all those <laughs> cringe compilation Sonic OCs. I think I can make a pretty good assumption. Wait, why am I doing pastel nice colors? There we go. Um I think that sponge will look good. Black out some basic shapes. That, that red looks beautiful enough. We're gonna use that to make the ears. She has the shark fin in the back. Mm -hmm. That looks pretty pretty good so far. Uh, wait, no, let's make this a primary color scheme so that we can make this um, have a deep emotional meaning. I, I don't know, a lot of people use color schemes. You think that I'm an artist and I know color theory? <laughs> what, kind of, what kind of joke is that? Okay. Now that we got this base, now we can start adding detail. Let's let's give him give him some let's give him some peepers. Give him a little mouth. <laughs> it looks like Bergie. Let's give her a bright green dress. Let's break up that primary color scheme. It'll stand out more. Let's add some piercings because it's not a MySpace OC without some piercings. That does not look like piercings. I don't know, it's just, there's some pe people add like weird highlight thingies to their OCs, so I guess we can just add that. Perfect. <laughs> it doesn't want to be alive. Ah, uh, Caitlin Draws Random asks me to draw her. Alright. For those who don't know, I'm actually pretty good friends with Caitlin, so I can do a pretty good drawing of her really fast. And there it is. I think that's pretty accurate to what she looks like. So let's do the big reveal. Um, I, I don't have any words. They're just, they're just so beautiful. This was a mistake. 